All right, my play today is Eli Lilly. It's a top trending ticker here on Yahoo Finance after UBS upgraded the stock to buy, saying that the pharma giant's type 2 diabetes drug, Monjero, could be one of the best-selling drugs in history. Now, UBS sees peak sales of $25 billion if the drug is also approved as an obesity treatment. Now, clinical research shared last spring showing that the drug helped people lose up to 22% of their body weight. The stock has actually done pretty decent so far this year. It's in the green compared to the losses that we're seeing in the broader market here. But Dave, the $25 billion here potential for this drug, if it is approved to treat obesity, could mean very, very strong returns here for Eli Lilly. It's a game changer, man. And the 22% of body weight is an average of 50 pound weight loss per participant in this uh, study. But now on the downside, it is a hunger suppressant. So it's not yeah. something that you can take, lose the weight and then go off of. Generally speaking, they're finding people have to stay on it. And maybe forever, genetics plays a role here unless you're gonna make a major lifestyle adjustment to exercise and diet. Um, anecdotally, talk to a couple of people out of my neck of the woods playing golf that are trying to get their hands on this diabetes drug that's used for weight loss, really? offering to pay four, five, six, seven times what it costs and cannot get their hands on it. This thing will fly really? if and when approved.